A brother says, what should we do if we are alone in an elevator and a person of the opposite gender comes in? This happens a lot when you are in an office building or in a hotel or in a residential building. You happen to be going from the 20th floor to the ground floor and you're alone in the elevator, it stops in the 15th floor, and in comes a woman, if you're a man, or a man, if you're a woman. So now, before the doors close, you think quickly, should I leave? Should I stay? It's only like a minute until the ground floor. And most likely, shaitan would prevail or confuse you. The doors are closed and the lift, the elevator goes down. Now, let's analyze what is sinful in what you're doing. It's only one minute, Sheikh. True. But the Prophet, alayhi salatu wasalam, said, no man is in seclusion with a woman except the third one with them is Satan himself. So is this a recommendation or a prohibition? Definitely a prohibition. So are you doing something sinful at the moment or not? The answer is without any doubt, yes. But what harm would there be? Regardless, maybe there is no harm. And maybe 99.99%, .99%, nothing would happen. Yet you failed in complying with the instruction of the Prophet ﷺ, and you hence sinful. Not only that, imagine if, and this is possible, the lift gets broken or bad or dysfunctional or it doesn't work, it stops for one reason or the other. You call the maintenance people, you call the emergency button, and they say, okay, we will look into it, and you're stuck there for an hour or two. People say, hmm, that's good, that's nice. No, it's not nice, it's sinful. Imagine your wife is in the same position. Would you allow this to happen? Imagine your sister to be in the same position. Would you think that this is okay? So, this is prohibited. What to do, Sheikh? Simple. Once it stops in the 15th floor or whatever floor and a woman comes in, you leave. Simple. There's, you don't have to be a rocket scientist to figure this out. Then what, Sheikh? Then call the elevator so that you take the next one. But this is a waste of time. It's better to waste your time rather than to waste your good deeds and Allah Azza wa knows best.